I kept quiet too long about this game. I got to talk about it. I don't know when this video is going to drop. I'll try to have a drop soon, but it's got to be said now. I got to talk about Azure Striker Gumbo 3. What is up, guys? You said Crimson Avenger here back to another video. This time around, as you guys received from the thumbnail and the title alone, this is going to be a rant video about Azure Striker Gumbo 3. But it's not about the gameplay. Gameplay, I love it. It's cool. It's fun. It's nice. But what I'm here to talk about is the story and how the character gunville has been treated and pretty much my thoughts on why things the way they are so let's get started with it so as a shocker govel 3 basically came out two months ago at this point uh two or three months ago and y'all can already tell that like, I, like i'm also already aware that gunvolt won't be the 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 focus focus main character because like they've NT Grace promoted that Kieran is gonna be the main character of this game, which was kind of already a ref, like as it is. Like, don't get me wrong, I'm. It's like I, I, I like Kieran. I love Kieran. She's, she's, a, she's a nice. She's a cool character. But the problem with it is like, okay, Gunvolt, what are we doing here? What, what's going on here? Like, I'll, I'll try to like go to some detail what's going on because this is all going from coming from the head. It's not scripted, whatever. But so. Gunvolt has been turned into a primal dragon for those who you know and for reasons I, they explained the game and I forgot what it was but it just randomly happened it just randomly happened in the past somewhere in Gunvolt 2 where Gunvolt was still staying with Quinn and he was happy and I feel like he shouldn't have to like nothing should happen to him he was fine he was fine at the end of GV2. The, the end of GV2 was a great send off to that character, if, you want be, if I want to be honest with you. But no, like they bring him back and you see him as this, as this dragon. And I'm just like, dude, what happened to you? And then like, it's, oh boy. I'm just going ahead and just get to the point. Like they killed him off in one of the endings, in the bad ending where like the final boss is Mobius. He's getting controlled by Mobius and if you don't get the true and then he, he he just gets himself killed and he he disappears like a kingdom hearts character and i hate that happened to him because he doesn't deserve that he doesn't deserve that at all like and then even if you do get the true ending he just disappears somewhere and i don't and this switch was right away he, he just disappears and i don't understand why he like i mean they kind of allude to you why he does but at the same time like you, you don't really understand he just, he just, he just turns into a ball of light and disappears somewhere. And even if you do manage to get the secret ending, it's more like a joke. It's a gag ending. It's a joke gag ending where we go back to the past. Where, because like for those who play GV2, there was a, a, a secret ending cutscene of all in Xiao and um, the maid. I forgot her name, but uh, Xiao had like a pendant that kept the muses, the, the muses power within it. Uh, everybody was suspecting like, oh, we're gonna be have, we're gonna have a follow up to it. What's this gonna about? What what's, what's Shao doing with that thing? And we get to find out what he did with it in this ending. He he finds middle, middle. Like I'm 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 glad she's okay, but we'll, we'll get there. We'll get there. She he gives the uh, the uh, the pendant middle, and she becomes a magical girl. Okay, like I guess like. I, I, <laughs> like it's like y'all want to do something with the character but there's really nothing you need to do with her but it's it's whatever but no it's not whatever but it just you don't need to bring her into the fight anymore and they she she she's a master girl and they they do nothing with it and besides that's all in the past most likely they're gonna make a game about that or a spin-off game depending if the fans want it or not but the problem I have is like, I don't need to know that middle's okay. I know she's okay. She's fine. The, the end of GV2 tells me otherwise. It tells me. It, I don't need to see this. This ending sucks. The secret ending sucks. And not only that, the Steam version of this game came out yesterday. Or the, the, at the time of, this, of the recording, it's now um, October 14th. So, pretty much the 13th, if not the 12th, the Steam version of this game came out, and I ran into a video on Twitter 
where when you get the true ending, there's a cutscene with Gunvolt conversating with Mobius, which is something we never got in the Switch version. I don't understand why. I don't know why they update the ending into the Steam version of the game. Why we have like we could have done it in the, in the Switch version. I don't get why you did that. I don't understand. I really don't. Like I'll let the clip play here so you guys can see it for yourselves. Because I, I know not all of you have the Steam version, but at the same time, for those who do have it, uh, don't don't watch this part. Just skip ahead. But here's the video clip. <laughs> これは。アストラルオーダーの力が僕に流れ込ん君はこの世界を守りたかっただけなんだね。アストラルオーダーと共に僕が命を絶てば破滅の未来を回避できる。そう考えていたけれど、そうだね。人に生きることを訴えてきた僕が自分の命を諦めるなんて許されない。それにも
most likely he's, he's gonna start again somewhere. But I really feel like they don't know what to do with Gunvolt. They really don't. And they just shot. They they gonna move away from him as the care as the primary character. And um, I I thought I had a friend, uh, I talked with a friend yesterday. Basically, I was saying like uh, the the director. I forgot his name, but like you, you'll know if I put him on screen or not. But the director, I pretty much just because like I know by by the time GV two ended, he feel like that he couldn't top GV 2s ending, which the ending of that game was amazing. The final, the final boss of the game was amazing. And he feel like he said, I, I remember reading it. He said it himself that like he felt like he did Gunvolt three already within Gunvolt two, and that everything was pretty much done. And he don't know what he can do to top because like originally he was gonna have Gunvolt disappear somewhere. But like I feel like the end of the GV two was like he did disappear somewhere. He disappears somewhere with Quinn, where he can live peaceful and happy with her. And I would have been down for that. As far as the third time, like, for Kieran, like, Chad, hell, this game shouldn't have been called Azure Shark or Gunvolt 3. It should have been called, like, Gunvolt Chronicles Battle Priestess Kieran or some shit. Uh, yeah, if you want to introduce Kieran that way, like, yeah, that, that could have been the case. I remember uh, the director also stated that, like, Kieran could have been in Gunvolt 2 as another playable character, but instead of that, uh, she's a character in the third game instead. And I'm like, okay, cool. I mean, I mean, I mean that will save time than just reporting the games again. If that's if that's the case, pretty much that's not a good idea. I wouldn't mind that. But and instead of that, we just got another gun, uh, another Gunvolt game, which I'm fine with. But man, I don't. Uh, I really. F no, like, I really feel like that Gunvolt got shafted, and they just don't know what to do with him. Him being overpowered, like, hell, there's a reason for that, actually. They, Because they feel like back in GV2, fans felt like, or there's, there was opinions over the net where uh, Copen was stronger than Gunvolt in 2. And don't get me wrong, he had a nice tool, tool set, but I didn't feel like he was that strong compared to Gunvolt, but... They, they really made him powerful just so they can kill him again. Or, not again, but actually, I would say again because he kind of died in Gunvolt 1, depending on which ending. And you come back to life thanks to thanks to, um, to Xiong. But at the same time, it's like, I I don't know what they can do with him. Because most likely, they could make another coping game, which I don't really care too much about after the first one, because the first game was, the plot of the first game was amazing. Second game was pretty eh, but Gunvolt, I don't know when, like, they do my boy, they do my, do my boy dirty. And, but this is pretty much going to be the end of this rant, but if you guys played the game or eh, if you own it, because I know some of you got the Steam version of it. Let me know what you think of it. Uh, tell me, tell me how you feel about this situation involving around Gunvolt. And let me know in the comments below. Leave a like if you enjoyed this rant. Like I don't, don't make rant videos, so you might not see this. You might not see me do rant videos like this often. But I'm gonna just go ahead and end it here. Uh, this is Uzi Avenger, and don't lose your way. Peace.